setting up a web server is super easy. We will be doing this in less than 5 minutes. So first go to Dermax and make sure that your repos are up to date. Then install Apache 2. Once it is installed, you can start your web server just by executing Apache CTL. You will see some more links here. Don't worry, we will be fixing this in few minutes. But first, open your browser and go to localhost 8080. And it works. But we have HTTP here and we don't want that. We need HTTPS. So to do that, again go to Termux and change your directory to prefix etc apache2. And now open this con file. Scroll down and just after server root, write server name localhost. Now press Ctrl W key on your keyboard and search for SSL and enter. Uncomment this line. Now again search for SHL, CB and uncomment this line also. Then again search for HTTPD, uncomment it. Then again search for HTTPD dash vhost and Uncomment it and that's it. We are done with this file. Just save it. Control X Y and enter. Create a directory SSL and give it required permissions. Now execute following to create SSL certificate and key and store them in the directory that we just created. Once it is done, then just ls ssl and here is our certificate and key now change directory to etc and open ssl con file and search for server name here you need to change example.com with localhost now search for cert scroll down and here you need to specify the certificate path that we created. Then search for key, scroll down and specify the key path we created earlier. Now we are done with this file also, just save it. Next, we need to open vhostcon file. Scroll down and here we need to change document root. So just create a new session and go to prefix share apache2 default site htdocs. Execute pwd. Just copy the path and again go to on file and paste the path. Next change server name to localhost. Now here at bottom write the following. Redirect slash https colon slash slash localhost colon 84443. Now, this will redirect all the connection to this URL, which is the URL of a server with https. Same you have to do for, for next host also. Then just save the file. Now, restart Apache server and open your browser. And if we reload, it redirected us to HTTPS connection, which is using 8443 port. This only is because we are using self-signed certificate. Just ignore it and continue to the site. And it works. Now if you want to configure backend like PHP, you can watch this video.